the agent they murdered. You knew him? He was a friend of mine. Sorry for your loss. I could say it comes with a job, but it doesn't get any easier. No, it doesn't. Guess you've been down here a while? I've been living as Karen Bowman, international aid worker, for just about five years. Means living rough, but as a cover, it gets me out and about. At least it comes with a chopper. How'd you get in country? I flew in business class from Manaus. Hey, I'm refreshed and ready for work, right? I just hitched rides from Barranco, Peru. How about you? I got on board a bus in Hui, Argentina, and drank all the way to Via Zone. Nobody wants to deal with a drunk on the bus. That explains why you smell like ass. <laughs> I've heard rumors about you guys. I was a rookie field officer in Moscow when the coup went down. There was talk you were involved? Nah, it must have been someone else. We were never there. It's not every day you get to meet an urban legend in the flesh. Huh, you should tell that to my kid. Maybe he'd listen when I tell him to take the trash out. Is it hard being someone who doesn't officially exist? You tell me, Karen Bowman, international aid worker. I'm sure you've seen the horrible, fucked up shit humans are capable of when there are zero repercussions. But let me tell you right now, no matter how you compartmentalize how you Desensitize, you can't prepare for El Sueño. He's got a religious street that rates pretty close to delusional. He's taken vows of poverty, chastity. If he's not in it for the chocha or the money, he's in it for the power. This joint task force is CIA, DEA, and JSOC. I'm your resident spook for this ride. Welcome to Operation Kingslayer. Our briefing said there'd be a contention of locals. The Qatar is 26. They're a group of rebels who've been giving Unidad and Santa Blanca some resistance. We'll meet their leader, Pat Qatari, soon as we touch down. Bolivians have a long history of hating us Yankees, but this time, let's hope the enemy of my enemy will be my friend. But don't turn your back on him. I'm not going to. Soldiers. This is the help you promised? That Sandoval promised? A single Yankee died, so you send a handful of soldiers. Hundreds of Bolivians have died from Santa Blanca's bullets. Where will my hundreds of soldiers come from? As Americans, we aren't here, remember? These soldiers are the best covert ops team our country has to offer. With their help, you won't need hundreds of soldiers. Are you familiar with the word Huber, Senora Bowman? Meet Pakatari, leader of the resistance group Kataris 26. We will be working with the rebels to destabilize Santa Blanca's organization. They've been fighting Santa Blanca and corrupt Bolivian officials for nearly six years now. We'll need to coordinate targets. There's no time for this. We have information on Amaru's whereabouts. Amaru? You found him? Amaru is one of the founders of the Kataris 26. More than that, her group is founded on his ideas. Without his theories of an agrarian proletariat, there would be no organized resistance against Santa Blanca and the corruption in our government. Amaru must be saved. If you were to assist my people, it would do much to earn my confidence. Where is he? We do not know exactly. We know he's in this province and that there is a Santa Blanca lieutenant who knows where he is. I'll put a call into the activity, see if they can dig more intel out of the airwaves. Start looking for that lieutenant and keep me informed of everything via sat phone. Good hunting. Saving Amaru is important to our cause, Yankee. Make sure you don't kill the Santa Blanca lieutenant before you get the chance to ask him questions.
got another tango. I got a third. Don't want to spook the target. Switch to suppressors. Got eyes on the target. Let's move. Tango down. We'll let the rebels know where to find these supplies. They could pay us back later. Eyes up, we got hostiles in the area. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendas? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Amaru. Where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Your thing? He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. Fast, 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 please. <laughs> we need to get this done in a hurry. Amaru's an old man. He's not gonna last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Maybe, maybe not. Amaru is a major player in the rebel movement. The cartel will keep him alive as long as they can to find out what he knows. We can't afford to take any chances. There's too much riding on this. Let's move. Careful, Sicario sporting a submachine gun. Next to that crate of comms here. second target. Let's get moving. The cartel isn't gonna wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru. Ready. Call the shot. Engage targets. Clear. How are you guys holding up?
sounds like a mass execution. The cartel's sending a message. Here's what happens to rebel sympathizers. They haven't been up there long. We must have really pissed somebody off on that last off. Go on without me. We got company. Stay sharp. Hey, we got a narco. The field. The drone is up. Spotting another tango. Marking a tango. He's close to that local. That makes five. Still good. I'm getting a position. Ready to fire. Enemy down. Coming up on a Toyo farm. Remember, a lot of these Sicarios are ex-military. ID your targets. If Amaru gets killed by a stray round, Operation Kingslayer will be dead in the water before it even starts. Let's go. Are you Amaru? What's left of him anyway? Come on, I'm getting you out of here. I'll pilot. Where are you taking me? Back to your friends. Entonces Pac Katari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, the young fool. Take it up with him, senor.
This is it. is not the most gracious of hosts. These Aukas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us see. Their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not... were not... Were their names Yuri and Polito? Si. Yuri and Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval while Sueño questioned him. I want them bad. We only saw run-of-the-mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's gotta know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Heads up. Bowman's file on Yuri and Plito is coming through. There were four people in the room the night DEA agent Ricky Sandoval was murdered. El Sueño, the head of the Santa Blanca cartel, Ricky, and the last two were La Yuri and El Polito. Yuri and Polito met at a poor state-run hospital in Chiapas, where El Polito was doing his residency, and La Yuri worked as a nurse. It was love at first sight. From the first moment their eyes met, they were inseparable. A love like no other. <laughs> One day, a Buchan named La Plaga walked into the ER, all shot up. It was touch and go for a while, but Yuri and Polito were able to save his life. La Plaga was grateful. He showered them with gifts, invitations to the most exclusive parties, even a new car. And after a while, La Plaga made Yuri and Polito the personal medical staff of the Santa Blanca cartel. But that wasn't their main job. See, Yuri and Polito know about the human body. They know how much pain a person can endure before he'll die. They know how to keep a person alive and awake so they can feel the pain. And most of all, they know how to inflict that pain. That's what they do in Itaqua province. When Santa Blanca captures someone that refuses to talk, La Yuri and El Polito make them talk. They break people. Like I said, there were four people in the room the night Ricky Sandoval was murdered. Sueño, Ricky, Yuri, and Polito. They kept Ricky alive while Sueño tortured him. Non-stop for 47 hours straight. They broke Ricky Sandoval. Then Sueño executed him. Nomad, I've got Pakatari on the line. Sounds like he needs our help. Put him through. Hola, compadre. I have a problem in Itaqua, and Bowman says you may be able to help. My people need help. There have been many losses to the cartel, and the horrors inflicted by Yuri Polito have broken their spirit. The fires of revolution have almost gone out. Spare me the rhetoric, Katari. Just tell me what you need. There is a cartel supply convoy passing through the province soon. 
Capturing it would give my people much needed supplies and restore their morale. Can you do this? Consider it done. We're taking orders from Pat Katari now? Katari needs this convoy. We are gonna give it to him. The more he depends on us to get shit done, the more we can get out of him in return. Engaging. Okay, we're still alright. Fuck, that's gonna leave a mark. Hola, amigo. You hear anything about the cartel around here? Where they are, or things like that? Gracias. Let's go. I'll catch up. This document mentions an Unidad captain who sends prisoner to Yuri and Polito for interrogations. He's got to know where our lovebirds are, but he's sitting in an Unidad firebase. Yeah. How long has that guy been hanging there? Jonas Amor. Maybe it was ours? Is he still alive? Check if he's breathing. Okay, we're still Ah, good. El Está Muerto. He's dead. He must have choked to death under that hood. Look at that bow in her. Mierda, I told you the hood was too tight. That's a big bow in her. Hey, we're good. I'm taking his pencil. Buckle up, people. Yuri. Ay. Are you jealous of a corpse, Piscocho? Let's roll. What the hell, Yuri? Whoa, ooh, this that guy cock stinks like shit. And he could have learned some grooming or something, but damn. It's like a chorizo that got rolled around in dog hair. Will you help me cut him down already? Or like somebody peeled a banana, covered it in butterscotch and, whoops, rubbed it on the barber shop floor? Yuri, knock it off. Oh, it's starting to sag. Now it looks like a toucan that hasn't shaved for a month. Amor, por favor, get your face out of there. You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo! Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. <laughs> you can't trust them. It would be a relief if I took them out of your life. Look, I'm not a snitch, but let's just say, yeah, they freak me out. The thing is, they're not even in Itaqua. So call them back to Itaqua. Tell them you've got a package ready. Uh. Oye, Olito. I got a lamp ready for delivery. Un borrego. Vale. Got data on a Santa Blanca antenna ripe for depowering.
makes five. Lucky target. Watch the background. Like we've riled them up. I call the rebels for some indirect fire. Got it, amigo. Shut out. position. Target marked. Ready to engage. Opening fire on these fuckers. That's one last bad guy. Go. Copy that. Targets confirmed. Ready to assault. Ready? Fire, fire, fire. Roger that. Trumped. Ready? Open fire. I copy. Got no tangos on my radar. Trucked him. Well, that was messy as shit.
Stay there. We'll go. Deploying drone. Got another tango. Tango number three. I got eyes on a sniper. Drone. Target's marked. Let's get, get, get the word. Sight line. Roger that. Target marked. Good to go. Got him. He's down. And baby makes three. Yo, we got a small cartel element inside the church. I'm getting a position. I'm gonna find a good position. I've got the target. Say the word, boss. Target is down. Yo, cartel gunman. position. Eyes on the target. Kill confirmed. That was close. Brings us to ten. I'm calling for indirect fire. Looks like they heard an explosion. Hold your position. Copy. Shit, we've been spotted. Rally up. Position. Moving to a good sight line. Target acquired. Standing by. Oh, 
shooting these fuckers. Target down. Fire. Roger. That's one less bad guy. Getting a position. Target marked. We're clear. Rally on me. Copy that. Oigan, gringos, help me get out of here. You okay, hermano? What do you want from me? Yuri and Polito, the fuckers who tortured you. We're here to make them pay for what they did. But we need to know where they took you. We didn't travel far. I... I remember that much, and it was quiet, out in the country somewhere. There... there was a smell, like old animal skins. That's all I know. I... I'm sorry. It's all right. At least now we know they're close by. Gracias. Nomad, we finally got a 20 on Yuri and Polito. The activity cross-referenced the car's GPS with that description you got from the prisoner. They're at a hunting lodge. Rumor has it they use that spot for their enhanced interrogations. Send us the location and we'll take care of it. Put them in the ground for me. Make sure they feel the pain. The drone is up. Advance on the lodge. Stay alert. We got tangos. Danger close. Move in. Watch those doorways and corners. Rally up, people. Roger that. This must be where Sandoval cashed in. Bowman said they kept him alive for 47 hours. Tough son of a bitch held out for a long time. <laughs> I feel like he was waiting for us to come get him, and we're real fucking late. Time to make it right. Cariño, who were you before you met? Mamacita, I was nobody. Nothing. I could not have even imagined a life so deep, a love so full as the love I have with you. Oh, God, I feel the same. I was half a person before I met you. I was afraid of Dimash. 
out of focus. Until I could see myself through your eyes. Damn. Just now when I was breaking that man's hands, I was imagining that he had tried to touch you. Come on. You're such a jealous man. And each finger I broke was punishment for a sin those hands had committed against you. Gordo, you're going to make me cry. I have... I have a confession. You know you can tell me anything. Anything at all. Before, when you drenched that man with water and I was electrocuting him with a cattle prod? But, Irina, that was textbook perfection. Let me speak. After that man had defecated himself because all the pain we had put him through, the suffering, <laughs> a passion like Christ, when he was lying there whimpering, I almost felt pity for him. I wanted to take care of him, to wrap my arms around him, to wipe away his tears. Yuri, look at me. What are you trying to tell me? Amor, I want to have a baby. What the hell are you doing? Take Bleed you slow. Roger. Open fire. Roger. Yuri is down. Terminated. You know how in the movies people always act like revenge isn't satisfying? Like it doesn't make them feel any better? Sure. Well, I'd feel fucking great. Taking out that lovey-dovey horror show also earned us some points with the locals. Make contact when you find something new. Bowman out. security infrastructure was being attacked. It made me question if La Plaga, our head sicario, was up to the task, or if he was too distracted with social media antics. Are you too busy chasing pussy on the internet to do your fucking job? Or is fucking your job? No, jefe. He's my brother, Sueño. I will keep him in line. La Plaga got the message too well. He doubled down. Whoever's behind this, know that we will find you. Know that for every one of us you kill, we will kill ten civilians at random. There is no such thing as innocent to me. The little pendejo had no idea how much damage he had just caused. <laughs> 